Killer bees coming up the far side of the field. Robo Sharks up the middle, fouled by the countdown. Meanwhile, Goon Squad scoring over on the near side. And Lightning coming up the front end. <laughs> Trying to get that hatch panel on. Keeps on getting dragged back. And they got it! Little trouble with getting that hatch panel. There they go. The killer bees get that hatch panel on for another two points. Robo Sharks working on the other side of the field. Swing and a miss by the killer bees. Now they quickly acquire some more of that cargo. And they pop it in there with authority. And they drop the second one into the same cargo hold, so there's no score for the second one in the same cargo hold. That cargo hold was empty. That's good for three points. Goon Squad trying to get past the defense of the Robo Sharks. Goon Squad swings and gets away from them. Gets over the Blue Alliance rocket on the near side of the field. Goon Squad trying to shake them. Robo Sharks were all over them. They got it, and the Goon Squad scores on the lower level of the Blue Alliance rocket. Just under a minute to play here. Gems dropping them in there. Here comes Lightning going to the mid level. Up into position. That's holding it in there. Nice placement by the Killer Bees out of Auburn Hills. That's a 30-second mark of this match. Cowtown over there trying to get some more hatch panels. Killer Bees making their way to the platform. It's a tie game so far. 15 seconds left. Lightning up for a three. Killer Bees are up for a three. Cowtown's going up for a two. Robo Sharks are up for a two. Got one second left. Can't tell on that one if the Goon Squad got the two or not. Can't tell from here. Let the zebras worry about that. All right, the lights are on. Let's get these robots off the field and get ready for semifinals number three. All right, let's take a look at our scores. It ended up being a tie. 